Okay. Hi, everybody. We are now in the next section. We're looking at creating an internal plan for a specific, either a course or a space. So I'm going to show you uh, the way to do that. And so in this section, we've already uh, went to this button and we've said, you know, plus create a plan. We're going to go to internal audience. So people who are already inside the Find Calm Here community is what we're going to do. And I'm going to say we're going to create a bundle. Let's do a bundle. All right. So um, a bundle is combining two spaces for people inside your network. Um, and this would be the same as if you create just a single cohort plan as well. So let me just go to that. So a single cohort, let's say we're going to create a plan for just um, the the um, the calm guide. So this is just to get the access to the calm guide that we're creating right now. Uh, and let's say I'm going to say it's a one time payment for this uh, plan. We're going to create a one time payment. And then I'm going to say, so they were already, already a member of Find Calm here. So they're already paying the membership fees. So we're just going to give them a discount, let's say, for um, the course. Or I'm sorry, not a discount, but we're going to give them a one time payment since they already have recurring payments from Find Calm here. And so we're going to pay, we're going to have them, uh, let's just put in there $4.97 because I'm going to charge $9.97 for the course for people who are not a part of the community. The people who are already in the Find Calm Here community get a 50% discount. So um, that's just, I'm just making numbers up right now. It's just FYI. Um, so that's the price. So my price would be $4.97 for this course. And this would be showing up to people who are in the Find Calm Here community. Um, this would be the description that you could use that you've taken from the course that you already created. So somewhere you've already created the course, you've had this content created, you have had a sales pitch and all of those benefits, and then you would actually create that plan. So that would be one option. The other would be a bundle for two places. So if I wanna invite the Find Calm Here community to join both the Mighty Mastermind and the book club, let's say, for example, I want to send people an invitation to have to invite them to both of those things. Then I could say um, it's free. Both of those spaces are going to be free. And then I'm just filling out the description of, OK, they're going to get access to the Mighty Mastermind and the Community Book Club with this plan. And then I'd you know, if there's images there, I'd fill out just a description and some of the benefits to like the Mighty Mastermind and to the book club uh, in a combination with a, a, a disc uh, description. Uh, and then I would uh, create the plan there. When we go to plans, just so you know, when you create the plan, it creates a, a link for every plan. So every plan has this special share link. So even if it's an internal plan, they still create a share link for you. So this is, um, you can see it's an internal plan and it says free and it says, so the thing to note about this is if you are, if you are doing a, a plan for an internal and you send them this link, they still would have to log in to your community before they would see the invitation to join. Like this is the Mighty Mastermind. So uh, if somebody wasn't a member of Find Calm here and I sent them this link, because this is the plan for the internal link, then they would have to be a member. And if they weren't a member, they would just go to the front of that landing page that says, you know, join the Find Calm here community. That's what they would see. Just to clarify that for you. So this is just talking about creating internal plans for people to see them inside your network. So when you're looking at the, the general cohorts here, the Money Mastermind, and then that manage would be where the payments and cohort plans. That would show you all of the plans that I've created and the current one that's visible right now. So I will show you another way to look at this for an internal plan in another section, but right now we will leave it there. Let me know if you have questions, if that wasn't clear, but that's how you create an internal plan or an internal bundle plan.